All right. And this will be the end of floor two. So just ignore that guy. He doesn't matter. We're just ignoring all these ghosts because they're not worth the time that they take to kill. Now. Oh, boy. So remember how I said this game doesn't have the full-fledged Kingsfield nonsense that later games will have? Well, I was only half talking shit. Yeah, that's that's just an invisible bridge that you can, you know, that's one of the only times in the game that lets you do that. I could not tell you why. Um, I'm 99% certain you need to use uh, feather boots in the original game to do that, but they're not coded correctly for this, so... <laughs> go ham? Go apple? Go banana? <laughs> it's pretty good, ain't it? Uh, so, yeah. Alright, so this dungeon partition, we need to get the, um, the what's it called? We've had to get one of these dragon, uh, trees, fruit things, fruit roll-ups. We've had to get those for, like, ages. We only need one to actually progress the game properly. Um, you can go here first if you want, but... I generally do this partition last, because at this point I'll have a lot more strength and these things will die a lot quicker. And plus, why would you want to do this part first? These things have so much fucking health. But we are one-shotting them almost. I think, what, two melee hits now? Let me check. No, but pretty damn close. I think it's three. Oh my god, maybe not. Fuck! Oh well, not a big deal. Poison... It's not that... It's never a problem in any of the Kingsfield games. I don't think it's ever been a problem in any of the Souls games either. It's more of an annoyance, if anything. Maybe it's... Well, it probably certainly sucks if you have epilepsy, I would imagine. But I think most things suck when you have epilepsy. I don't know how people have epilepsy and live with it. That just seems like a constant stress level that I don't know how people can deal with. Okay, so Lizard Man Trogdor guy. Excuse me. So I think there's a dragon leaf in that partition, so I'm going to go back and get it. I don't know why I'm calling it partition so much now. I just love that word. Would you like to sign my partition? <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Would you like to sign my petition? Listen, sign the petition or I'll murder your family. Sign it, damn it. <laughs> uh, Postal 2 is fun. I love how I love how I'm like, oh, I fucking hate trash media where it's just like being edgy for the sake of being edgy, but I absolutely adore Postal 2 for how juvenile it is. It's like South Park, but without fun. I think that's what makes it funny. And it's so jovially shit. Well, I've only played the... I played up till Paradise Lost came out, and I just... I don't know, I went through a phase. I just said, oh, I don't feel like playing edgy games anymore. I'll just listen to edgy music. I'll, one, I mean, they're not mutually exclusive, but, you know, I, I switched out edgy video games for edgy music. You know, I don't think you can get more edgy than black metal. I really don't. I don't, I don't think that's physically possible to get edgier than the most edgy music possible. Someone said I was true cult the other day, and it made me happy. I'm talking, like, in public. He was wearing a CC shirt, and I was like, oh, nice CC shirt, bro. I recognized it through his work apron, by just the E's and the C in the corner. That's how fucking ingrained I can tell you, like, a Cannibal Corpse t-shirt. And, uh, he was like, oh, thanks. It, like, lit up his fucking eyes. He was so happy. Um. But no, I... I don't know. I don't think you can get much more edgier than black metal after a while. Anything else is just trying too hard. Or it is the definition of trying too hard, and I'm just coping, right? <laughs> it's possible. But to be fair, I really only like Atmo Black. I love traditional black metal, but I do, I do like, uh... I, do, I like my Atmo Black. I like my weird, big, spacey, reverb-filled fucking... Oh, it's good shit. So, this is a save point. Fucking activate the damn thing. There we go. It's not this controller, either. The controller is absolutely fine. It's just this... I've actually not mentioned this yet, but there is delays in the menu. I've just kind of adjusted to it. I don't know if that's good or bad. 
But uh, this branch right here has the NPC we need to talk to. And I mean, you need to talk to him. What the fuck? That shit went right over his head. That was absolutely goddamn ridiculous. Alright, this is like the help me! Yeah, Heinz. I love ketchup too. <laughs> it's true. I you wanna know a fun story about me and ketchup real quick? When I was a little kid, I was absolutely petrified of ketchup. And do you wanna know why? I thought it was spicy. Yeah. I thought ketchup was like disgustingly spicy because there was a pepper in the logo. So we talked to the dude from Resident Evil 4, the Castanella, and then we use where is it? There it is. Use it. Bum, 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 bum. This is such a fucking intense soundtrack. This is the last time the music actually changes. It's kind of a shame. So we got the harp. We've been through this. It's a harp, and you know it. Um... This is essentially the flute, if you've played Kingsfield uh, American. I hey, wait a minute, I've seen this shit before. This game's ripping it off. So it is a little finicky. You have to play it in a very specific angle. And blammo! Look at that. Fucking pro strats, right? Am I right, guys? Alright. So, we can get a couple more items now with this. And we can actually finish this floor. So, oh shit, look at that. Oh, how do I get over there? I bet I just walk over it. No, don't do that. You'll fucking die. I'm not exaggerating. You will literally plummet so hard. Go over here. Oh wait, no, I'm dumb. Don't listen to me. I don't know fucking anything about this game. Uh, <laughs> actually, all that's over there is a Verdite. I'm pretty sure. So, all right, fuck it, we'll go get it. Why not? I can't ignore it. Because I do know how to get it. Oh, fuck, this is a nasty spot to get through. This music is so fucking intense. I love that, that like, sound font they use for this synth is so fucking cool. If you've ever heard, uh... Oh, I know where to... I know where it's at. Don't don't pay attention to me. Um, if you've ever heard early Ramstein, they use a similar synth in um, their their title track Ramstein, like bump 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 bump. Like if you've ever also played uh, Metal Slug, that also gets used a lot in Metal Slug games too for the sound font. All right, now we can use these with reckless abandon, baby. Oh, feels good. So now we no longer need to actually buy and hold on to any items. We can just spend, spend, spend. We're gonna, we're gonna fucking break capitalism. <laughs> All right, so this is actually where we get the verd item, pretty sure. Am I correct? What? Bullshit. I know that you can get that through here. Oh, wait, no, I'm dumb. It's on... <sighs> don't listen to me. I don't know anything about this game. This is my first time playing it. I'm just really making it look easy. I forget that this is an angle thing. So... <sighs> Let me shoot my sperm at you. There we go. That won't upset parents. That won't make people mad to know that the video game's projectile is semen. Well, actually, if this guy can ejaculate that quickly with his refractory period being less than three seconds. More power to you, man. I don't know how you pulled that shit out. Alright, so go ahead and use the harp. Sissy girly music thing. Oh, I can't believe they got away with that. They got away with it. They called it a girly thing. So? <laughs> I bet someone tell me the Emperor's New Groove didn't have a script, and that's the only time I actually believe one of those weird rumors. Because the source is also accurate. I trust her word. <laughs> but also because, like, that movie's really bullshit and not very well made. It's just not good. I mean, it's... Okay, if you've never seen The Emperor's New Groove, 
you're really not missing anything. It's it's not very it's not like the best movie ever, but I can believe it doesn't have a script. So this is a Verdite, I know that for a fact. Get fucking in my inventory, there we go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. But no, that movie is not very good. Oh Jesus. It's getting spicy in here too. It's like 80 degrees outside and it's only like 10 o'clock. People would go, oh, Oregon, you must have, like, fucking rain all the time. No, we have rain every, like, blue moon. And then... Oh, what am I doing? Why don't I just do this? Ugh. Fucking idiot. So, yeah, we have rain a lot, but that does not mean it doesn't fucking get hot. It gets up to, like, 113. That's, like, the triple-digit normality that we deal with in the summer. It's also fire season right now. Shit's... Shit's just on fire outside, dude. That's why my voice sounds kind of racked, too. But no, I I would totally believe that movie doesn't have a script, because it's not very good. Um, let me see. What am I th I think I've got everything for this floor. Pretty sure we're, we're golden. We're Gucci, mate. Ow. Now I just gotta get to the end of the dungeon. Which, uh, no, it's this way. That's right. This place is easy to get turned around on, because... Can I just be honest? Everything looks the same. <laughs> Does it not look the same? Am I losing my shit here? Is this wrong to say? Everything looks the same. Alright, also, if this never procs, it's just because you're standing in the wrong angle. And the bridges also collapse, so don't fuck around and stand on them either. There's actually a puzzle later on that requires you to do that. And we cannot open those three chests, so don't fucking worry about it. Alright. Oh boy. So this is where the game officially goes... Alright, champ! You know what you're doing! So... I'll see you guys in the next one. See what that guy on the right-hand side's all about. I bet you he does a lot of damage. Cause he's a high soldier. That's right, I'm an Oregonian. <laughs> coming after you.